Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today we're going to do something um, a bit different. I am going to just show you, I'm sure somebody of you, some of you have done it, but I'm just going to use some gel polish for something else than nails. So I've taken out, first of all, I've taken out this acrylic brush. You see it has this um, glitter, which is running through the brush and this is obviously plastic so <clears throat> it's already had a little monomer touching it and it's like making it melt kind of melt so to make sure that doesn't happen you can this is just the first thing i'm sure most of you have seen this this is something i should have done before uh, i'm just wiping it off a bit uh, you can just use, I'm going to use the Madame Glam, and you can just use a no wipe top coat and apply that over the brush so it won't melt the monomer, you know, won't melt the plastic. So this is like tip number one, if you say it that way. Uh, as I said, I know this has been done by a lot of people. They do this every time they get a new brush and... It is a very good idea to do that. Um, you might even do it on wooden brush and yeah, whatever brushes you have, if you top coat them, you know you won't they won't be that you won't tear them down that easily. Like let's say when you have the liner brushes, whatever whatever kind of brushes you have, gel brushes, if they are like wood, they very easily get worn out where you hold it, right? you hold the brush so you can just top coat the handle and it will stand you know for much more than not top coating it if you know what i'm saying um so this is just i don't know if i've been around now i think so um yeah so this is just like one um, as i said i'm sure you guys seen this around but I'm just giving you that tip again if you don't, if you haven't seen it. So I'm just going to cure that and then we'll take a look. Yes, I just was just swirling it like this in the lamp and it is see-through. So cured nice in 30 seconds. So that made, made that brush a bit more, um, yeah, so it will hold a bit better. Uh, for the monomer um the next thing i have in mind you see all these so i'll take these out and i'll show you this is just something i thought of that would be a very good idea i'm sorry there it goes because if you look at these brushes these are all different brushes um these are just aliexpress brushes um but you see they are completely they are like completely the same there is a couple that is shorter that's all but except from that they look exactly the same so if i need one of these brushes i have to open up to look you know okay there i found the shortest one straight away but usually i won't <laughs> so they are like they are all the this is a 3d brush so they all look the same this is a um, small but a tiny bit longer than the first liner brush and I got, and this is a small gel brush, you can call it, cleanup brush, whatever. And this is a, um, that angle brush. And here is another that is even longer. So, you know, all these is, it's hard to find the right one, right? You don't know which is, which is what, because as you see, it doesn't have any, writing except from the name it doesn't have any number or what it is or anything like that so i thought okay i'll show you on this brush i thought the shortest little um detailer brush you see how tiny that is it's a tiny little super nice brush actually but yeah i thought about this to make it easier to yeah um them apart you will also when you use this you will 
the red will go off you know when you keep holding it and all of that stuff i'm just cleaning it to make sure it is clean okay so i'm not gonna bother base coating i'm just gonna go straight in with madame glam's purple ho ho holo and this is so beautiful so i just want to do this to make it you know stand out so i will know that the shortest tiny detailer brush has a purple handle you know it is going to be purple i don't need the name or anything like that it doesn't matter um <clears throat> while i'm doing this i'm going to tell you about a amazing sale that madame glam is gonna have the 20th january 20th to 21st you are gonna get 50 percent off their website using my code which will be in the top right corner and it is cami 50 jan cami 50 J A N. You'll see it in the top screen, and I will also leave the link and the code in my description box, the top of my description box. If you click that link, you don't have to add my code. If you click my link, it goes automatically. So the January twentieth to twenty first, yeah, twentieth to twenty first, you will get fifty percent of all products. And that is amazing sale. That is like a Black Friday sale, you know. So I just want, wanted you guys to know about that while I was doing this. This will need two coats because the red, you know, is very, yeah. The red is a bit too dark, which I'm not surprised about. I could, of course, have taken um sanding band, you know. Uh, sanding paper I mean and you know sand it sanded the color off or what you call it sanded I don't know what you call it anyway you know what I mean <laughs> but yeah I just chose to do it you know fast and simple without much extra and these brushes are actually pretty matte you know the handle is isn't that glossy it's more matte like half matte so I thought it's okay and i clean it good it's okay i could obviously have base coated it to make it you know stick even better but yeah but this is just gonna you know make the brush prettier and it's gonna be very easy for me to see you know what like which brush this is you know i'm gonna totally know that this is the tiny little detailer brush so it's just like some small things you oh gosh some small <laughs> small things you or fun things you can do with gel polish except from just on nails you know there is you can pimp up shoes you can i don't know there is like yeah you can do whatever there's so much you can use gel polish for i just thought about oh my word and I keep touching it. <laughs> Just thought about a few things like this that I wanted to do. So I thought, why not? You know, why not? So I'm going to do guys. the second coat and I'm going to speed that up for you guys, or it's going to be so long. brush is done it is top coated and it is purple holographic 
I was gonna put my name on, but I forgot before I top coated. But it was just a little extra fun, you know. I can still do that and just top coat the stickers, but yeah, um, I forgot about it. I forgot about it. Sorry, guys. So let's see if the oh, the cap is working better now. Look at that. I'm not doing anything with the cap, obviously. So now I can, I'm sorry for the noise. Look at that. Now I can tell it apart, you know. This is my shortest, my, um, yeah, smallest detailer brush. So, you know, really easy way of telling your brushes apart and get like a brush that nobody else has. I'm sorry for the noise again. Uh, the other thing I want to do is, you see this um, tip display stand, you see these, you have this like uh, metallic pink, you see this one, um, my first use took off the, I'm using glue dots and the color, um, yeah, followed, went off. What I should have done, what I, that I forgot, or I've never, I've never, this have never happened before with the regular silver ones or any of those, but yeah, I should have top coated them first. So that's one thing you can do to make sure they won't, you won't lose the paint like this. It's top coated before you use it, but I wanted to just try my no wipe top coat. I'm running low on the top coat. I'm running low. Um, let's try this one which is almost completely black so I'm gonna just top coat this da, 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 the top of it I'm just gonna see how it's gonna uh, look and I'm gonna cure it for just like a little I'm not gonna fully cure it just like a full cure is 30 seconds right I'm just gonna do like a 15 second and cure take this this is I guess it maybe has a little holographic in it, but that's not a big deal. Um, I can take it from the lid and we're going to smack it on over. Look at this. It's almost even almost the same. And since it's, you know, a black, uh, it's black under the color. It is working perfecto. Perfecto. <laughs> What you even can do is you can do it with the you know with the hole i'm just gonna put this lid on again because because if not i'm sure i'm gonna get it all over just gonna yeah i've just rubbed this chrome over like that and it is matching right it is holographic but it is matching i could have used this one too but i didn't feel like it was the same looks more the same on the camera but not in real life um what i also can do is use the madame glam naughty me i thought we could try that on this one i'm not sure if i'm going to keep it on but you can also do that you know when you have the white ones i have a pack with the white uh with these in white you could always pimp those up too you know with gel polish top coat chrome whatever you know Whatever you want. Uh, this is going to take, obviously, a couple of coats. But look at that. <laughs> that was so cool. That's really cool. Look at that. That's the gel polish and this is the chrome. I think that's cool. I think I'm going to cure that. You can do that, as I said, on the full. You know, we can do it on the all of the tip stand but it works it's just something you can do different so like let's say do this with the whole black or white one just to get it like a bit different you know like your own and put it all over it would be really cool and then we need to top coat it I'm gonna top coat it and i would take the top coat you know a bit around so the top coat isn't just on the top it is also a bit around here, so it will tie it a bit more. So yeah, these are just like some, you know, funny things you can do. You can, I don't know, as I say, you can do so, you can pimp up so much or change so much using gel 
polish and different stuff use the top coat and chrome and yeah all kind of stuff uh, man and glam have chrome powder too have the chrome pens and yeah so but remember the sale is for tomorrow and say it is january 20th to 21st so just so you remember that it starts tomorrow and as i said if you click my link the my code is automatically put on if not if you don't click my link you're gonna have to write it in the the coupon uh code so yeah i think it's a great sale this is this is a vip you know vip get 50 percent, but not on the full website that's just when it's sale is on gel polish and this i mean is the full website so you will get everything for 50 percent off i think that is such a great great sale for everybody you know? here you see the original ones of course this was holographic so if it would have been not holographic it would have been more the same as this one i'm sure i have one somewhere but i just found that one first and i took it because i didn't care if it's a bit holographic you know it doesn't it doesn't matter and here is i think this one was really cool it looks it's so neon around it's like super neon glow pink it's glowing around the sides it's so cool can you see that I don't know if it shows up that good in camera, but it's really cool. And that's only one coat. I could have could have taken two coats and gotten it more opaque, but I liked it like it is. So I might do this on the rest of these, actually. I think so. I think I will do it on the rest. I have topped all of them off with the Naughty Me Holographic Pink. This pink is just... Oh, this pink and purple is just amazing. And I've top coated them, but look at that. Kind of cool. Kind of want to do it on the full, <laughs> on the full one. But yeah, that is just some ideas of what you can do, except from using gel products, except from nails. You know. So here you see how the brush was before, and here it is afterwards. So you see the difference. I think is really cool. Like I got my own brush, you know. My own homemade brush so yeah you can stick on my name whatever you want you can do whatever you want you can make it matte i mean this was just an easy you know simple way but yeah just some ideas of what you can use the gels for so that is it guys i'm gonna leave you now it took long enough but yeah remember the sale tomorrow okay from january 20th to 21st 50 percent off the full website with my code cami 50 jan okay you will see the code on the screen and in my description box click my link and you will the code will automatically be applied okay so thank you so much for watching i hope you liked it if you did please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so you get notified of all my future videos you have to click all though <laughs> and hopefully i will see you in my next video bye